hope for Central America's white turtle. In Guatemala's lush jungle, conservationists like Elazar Gonzalez are working to save the endangered reptile from extinction. In recent years, the species has fallen prey to poachers who sell the turtles' meat and eggs at food markets. But Gonzalez is bringing the turtles to a safe haven in Del Tigre Natural Biosphere Reserve, where the eggs will hatch in safety with the aid of incubators. We continue to monitor the white turtle. These were done by incubating eggs using two incubators we have here at El Paru Lagoon. We have 60 eggs in the incubators, and from those 60 we managed to release 20 turtles six months after hatching. They were released here into the same lagoon. The Wildlife Conservation Society team measures and identifies the turtles to get a better read of the existing population. When fully grown, the white turtle is larger than most other species, but its passive nature makes it easy to catch. It inhabits river systems throughout Central America, but veterinarian Manuel Lepe says continued monitoring is essential. It is special because it does not exist anywhere else in the world. Its anatomy has evolutionized the way it has because it is a river turtle exclusively. If one places it on land, it could harm the turtle. Laguna del Tigre is located inside the vast Mayan biosphere reserve, a protected area. But conservationists say the park is still under threat from poaching and other illegal activities. They hope their efforts to rebuild the population, combined with stricter local laws, will help save the rare white turtle from altogether disappearing. Sharon Reich, Reuters.